Hi, this is Sam at King David Coffee Roasters in Nashua, New Hampshire. The website is kingdavidcoffee.com and today I want to talk to you about what is specialty coffee and also speak a little bit about organic and fair trade. Uh, so coffee, first of all, in its unroasted form is green. It is the seed of a red cherry on a coffee plant and the cherry is depulped, the coffee is washed, dried, and put in burlap bags, which are generally 70 kilos, 154 pounds. So what, what is the difference between specialty coffee and regular coffee? The definition is the top 6% of the coffee crop in quality are the specialty beans. Um, they are generally from very small farms, three to five acres. Uh, there may be hundreds of farms in a valley. Uh, the farmers will bring their coffee cherries to a central processing mill where they are depulped and put in the burlap bags uh, and then make their way to brokers in the United States and then I purchase from those brokers uh, the warehouse uh, is on the East Coast is in New Jersey so I can generally order uh, a pallet of coffee and have it here in a couple of days. Uh, what makes the coffee special? Uh, farmers who pay attention and believe in quality properly pruning the plants um, altitude and region all have something to do with it and when you have a very high quality coffee it's really good if you brew it as a single origin uh, or roast it as a single origin and not blend other coffees with it and that is my preferred style. Each coffee has its own distinct flavor profile and uh, body, thin body, thick body, whatever depending on how I roast it. So these are the finest coffees you can find or among the finest coffees you can find. Uh, organic and fair trade. Uh, I have a little bit of an issue with those terms. Uh, they're wonderful things to have, but organic means just that. It's organic. It has nothing to do with quality. It may be fantastic. It may be not so good. Uh, fair trade uh, means that the farmer is guaranteed a minimum amount or a contracted price for their coffee. Um, which generally is a little more than they would get otherwise and that's a great thing uh, but again it has nothing to do with quality it may be great it might not be uh, so when I source my coffees I'm not specifically looking for organic and fair trade some of my coffees are but that is secondary to me I'm always looking for the highest quality coffee that I can find so that's a little bit about coffee and what makes it special, where the high quality beans, what, what they do to make them as good as they are. Uh, I sell my coffees at kingdavidcoffee.com, wholesale to the public. It's only eight sixty nine a pound, roughly half of what others charge for similar coffees. Uh, hope you try some soon. Thank you and take care.